Hello. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. Good. Oh. So excited to be here at Heisel Elementary. It's so exciting to have you here today. So we've really spent a lot of time just talking about building connection and a sense of belonging in our new building, really getting to know each other's names and where they came from and the beauty of all of us coming together and then really have started talking about how can we use that sense of belonging and connection to really empower learning. Um, well, so that's one I'm of the pieces we've been it. talking about I'm excited here at Heisel. I'm going to visit a third grade classroom today. So they currently are in their um, interactive read aloud. During that time, we've been talking about connections and families. Each of our children had the opportunity to talk about the story of their name. Oh, I love this. So you can see they've taken a picture and then they talked about how they got their name and the why. These are so cute. I could stay out here and read all of these too. How fun. Let's go in and visit a class. And I was reading some of y'all's stories and y'all talked about your names kind of being part of tradition, similar to this. Does anyone in here have a name that's like a tradition too that they want to talk about? My name is Ayanti, so it can like show my culture, um, which is Africa and Nigeria, but I come from New Orleans. So like it's to show all of my culture. He passed that generation down to me and he named me Tavares after his name so I could remember him whenever he passes away. Yeah, the, creating that legacy like in your book there, right? Something that goes on forever and ever. That's pretty awesome. I saw these wonderful stories of self and every student has a picture and it has a story about their name. Can you tell me a little bit about that and like how does that feed into boating community and relationships? One of the biggest things that is important to me is making sure that our classroom feels just like a family and in order for me to do that I felt like it was important for me to understand who they were as a person and so I read the story called Alma and how she got her name and we use that as a great mentor text to feed to students. It's been fun to use that to get to know one another, but then to also make us really feel like a family because that's going to ultimately make them comfortable at school, which will lead to learning. Opening new elementary takes lots of staffing, you know, getting everyone here. Can you tell me a little bit what that's been like? Just the work our district is doing to support and recruit teachers and staff is amazing. And so Ms. Garza, she's new to profession, exactly. you mentioned, right? And then we also do a mentor program. So Ms. Garza um, has a mentor um, who supports her throughout the year. Okay. Just lots of layers of how can we help you feel supported so you can do your job and help students learn. Thank you so much for welcoming me and showing me around campus. I loved every piece of it. And I love in every classroom, in every space, you can really see this connection to community and learning and honoring everybody as, as an individual and as part of the family. It's really beautiful. Thank you. So that's one of the things that we believe is that children feel connected and a sense of belonging. I'm now officially a Heisel Hound. Heisel Hounds, how loud and proud.